Hey guys, welcome to my YouTube channel. So today I've got a huge pretty little thing haul for you all. Um, just as we're all bored in quarantine and there's nothing better to do than shop and pretty little thing. But today I'll be trying on all the clothes. Um, I do have a couple of dresses as well as obviously tops bottoms, jogging bottoms, etc. I'd just like to say this video isn't sponsored by Pretty Little Thing in any way, shape or form and all opinions are my own. Okay, so these are the leggings. Um, they just feel like normal leggings to be honest. Thin, but like they seem quite soft, like a comfortable um, type material. Um, like I said, they were £4.80, which I think for a pair of leggings ain't too bad. Um, and I quite like these because they're high waisted. Like, I'm not really keen on leggings that sit at your hips. I'm not a big fan of those. I literally hate them. But for the length, again, they look just like a normal size eight. Hopefully, they look nice on. So let's go try yeah, these leggings. They're the most tiniest bit see through, but definitely not the worst I've had for the price. Like just like four pounds, like love them i really like how high waisted they are um the bottoms i will show you <laughs> i will show you closer up are uh, definitely long but i did get them in a size eight so they literally fit me perfectly i wouldn't want to go a size down um but literally on the waist they're not loose or anything they fit surprisingly <laughs> they fit perfect so i'll show you the bottoms to take a closer look okay so that is top of the leggings and then as I said again even that's like that's even like scrunched up they're very long I'm about five four five five um just in case you wanted to know um I'll roll these up okay so I've rolled them up please ignore the TV <laughs> on the floor um and yeah I'm really like happy with these and shocked so i'm gonna move on to the next item um i will be pairing some of the tops with the bottoms that i'm wearing because um i think i'm like one off um a whole outfit so ignore all this <laughs> um yeah Let's see what the next one fits like okay so next up i have got these lilac basic slim fit joggers um okay i ordered these off the website because i thought you know, i'm normally quite a plain person so i thought maybe going for some purpley type joggers would be all right i mean i really like the color of them to be honest yeah and i did get these in a size six because i haven't really ordered bottoms of pretty little thing before so i wasn't quite sure um what size to get but hopefully a six should fit and these were 12 pound which i get i think Actually, it's not too bad to, you know, some of their joggers on their website are, like, £20, so... They are quite thin. Like, normally I do wear quite thick joggers, but we're going into the summer, so... These joggers do have a cuffed bottom, just like the tops. They don't have any pockets, so I did, I did think they would. But I'm guessing it's the £20 ones that do have pockets. So, okay, so let's go see what they're like. So... As you can see, these are the joggers. Again, the length is pretty much exactly the same. If I pull them all the way down. Um, but yeah, no, I feel I feel like they look like the picture. I mean, they don't suit me the best, but they're not terrible. Okay, so these are the joggers closer up. Um, they don't look as purple on camera, but they definitely are a little bit more in real life. This is what they're like. Um, I probably wear these around the house a lot. I feel like, I don't know, I don't feel like they really suit me. I definitely like wear them around the house. Like, um, like I said, I've got no pockets, but um, I wouldn't rate these bad, like, especially for the price. It is literally half the price of some of the other joggers, which are like 20 pounds. So yeah, I know, quite like these again. Quite good material, even though they're thin, you probably wouldn't want them to be much thicker, to be honest, because you probably will get a bit hot. So, um, yeah, no, I really like these. So next up, we have this pretty little thing, Race Logan t-shirt, which I got in a size small. I don't know if you can see, but... Oh. 
that's what it says on the top decent stitching quality i mean i do quite like this actually i just would have it more cropped to be honest because it looks like it sits more at the waist which i'm not that keen on but maybe if it's long enough i could tuck it in just like a t-shirt but yeah like, like the other stuff it does seem quite decent quality i feel like as it's at a bottom cut like this it might um roll up after you've washed it which i mean some people might like some people might not so this was eight pound which i don't think again is too bad for the price like i said it was 20 percent of all of it so yeah so let's see what it's like on this is the crop t-shirt like i said it is already rolling but i mean it doesn't look too bad for me like i said personally it's too long but obviously for someone else they might like their t-shirts like this personally i'd probably have it a lot more like this um but obviously it isn't quite that length i definitely wear it tucked in more like that I, I personally i think it looks a bit better but obviously it might look better on someone else when it's not pulled out but that's just how i like it but again like, i think this top's great like i love it i feel like just simple um it, I, think, I feel like it would just go with anything so yeah okay so next up we have this black plunge ring detail bralette I see everyone wearing this and I've always wanted to try it. Okay, so here's the top. It has the ring detail in there. Um, these straps are quite thick and very long, but um, I'm guessing you can tie it around the back and then tie it around the front, which I feel like with these tops is quite useful having long straps because you can tie it how you want it and have it dress it up, dress it down, wear it during the day. I got this in a size 6 and it cost £8. Um, again, I don't think it's too bad for the price. I mean, it's kind of heavy for a top, but that is because obviously of the um, ring detail and in the middle. Um, sizing again, looks quite decent. Um, obviously, it's more adjustable because how tight and loose you want the straps. So I think that's quite good. Um, it does remind me a bit um, like a swimming costume, the material of it. But it is double layered and it is quite thick and like when I hold it up to the light it doesn't look see-through at all so I'm hoping this will look as good as it does on so let's go try it out okay so like I said I literally love this top tied it at the back um there's plenty of ways you can tie it great material it just reminds me like a bikini but like you said you can dress it up and dress it down so that's why I love it so much definitely would recommend and um making sure I keep this Okay, so next up we have this brown rib strappy back back bralette. And I got this in a size four, which obviously is a lot smaller than um, a six or an eight. I quite like it because it's different because the straps go like round your arms like this, um, and then it sits around your back, which is basically backless. Um, it is in brown because I couldn't find any other colours. And I got a size four because I feel like these straps might fall down. Um, I've had no problem with the other stuff. I don't normally go for, like brown the clothing, but actually I think it's quite nice. And when I see other people wearing it, I want it. I just want to wear it myself. So this cost three pound. I think it was in the sale, but it cost two pound forty with the, the discount, which I think is amazing. Like can't go wrong for two pound forty for a top that literally looks like lush, I love it. Um, it does look quite small as in, as I've got to try and get my head around that. Doesn't look very big, but um, I feel like it would feel quite weird because of the way it's sat, but we'll see. So let's go try it on. So, this is the brown top. I literally like, love it. It's something like really different. That's the back. Um, never seen anything like it before it does definitely feel weird with straps like this um and the i did get this in a size four just for the fact that i didn't want the straps falling and they've fallen down so much already it's really annoying which is such a shame because this top was really cheap and looked really nice um i mean like i said i didn't i'm not keen on the color but actually it literally makes the top makes up for it, it looks so nice um it's just like i say a shame it is a bit like this 
and I really did struggle to get this on like oh god it was like a workout and it's going to be even harder to get it off um it's a bit of an awkward top but it's such a shame because it looks this really is the nice top um in the mirror um like i said i love it just like a shame such a shame that these straps here fall down because the back one's fine the thing is for the straps to be tight obviously it's got to be small so when trying to get it over your head it's just nearly ripped it but um yeah hopefully getting a bigger size it'd fit a little bit better and maybe i just have to like tie the straps okay i've been looking forward to this one so much it looked really nice on the website it's a white corset hook and eye crop top got this in a size six it does look very um low um so we'll see how that fits let's um okay yeah these corset hook and eyes do come undone which is useful to taking off over your head um this cost 12 pound which is more on the pricey side of all this stuff it was 15 pound without the 20 percent, so i definitely want to try and get some discount off it but again it's something i'm not used to wearing um but i'm excited to try it on it does feel quite thick it's definitely more of a sporty not as a sports top but it's it feels like more of a thick like gym wear material that you would buy when getting a sports bra or something but no yeah i'm hoping it looks good on so yeah let's try it oh, i literally love this top very um low cut here um the hook and eye thing which i love because it's easy to get on and off especially if you're wearing a full face of makeup and this white top and you don't want to ruin it i probably might size up in it because it is tight it's a comfortable tight but it might be a little better sizing up like i like these shoulder bits and everything i think it's definitely um different recommend this top 10 out of 10 i love it um the back's just like that and yeah um haven't got really much to complain it's just a bit annoying obviously like this bit here but um yeah just gonna size up and it'll be perfect this combo together i literally love so again dress it up dress it down and yeah so next up i have these white basic cuffed hem joggers size six um they did have these in loads of other colors and in gray but i thought i'll go out there like i did with the lilac joggers and get two different colors i wouldn't normally wear just because i feel like they would get dirty very quickly um as they are really white but um they're very similar to the other ones but the other ones are skinny and these aren't um again feels about the same quality as the lilac ones and yeah i can't wait to try these on i think it'll go quite nice with a bodysuit which i do have coming up next so yeah let's go see what they look like so on. these are the white joggers um like the way they fit they're again t the most tiniest bit see-through um they do fit better than the lilac ones um not that keen on the bottoms of them because they do go very big and they fall down quite easily I feel like it looks better uh, with a t-shirt but obviously you can wear it what you want like i said the bottom's definitely a lot more baggy arcus like that personally i'm not that keen on these on myself but definitely on someone else i feel like they look better um i would definitely buy them again again if they fit in the style of the lilac ones okay so next up we have this black scoop neck high leg bodysuit um definitely had bodysuits before but i'm not like keen on because i don't find them that comfortable but i did see this on the website I really wanted to try it out like it looks like a normal like vest type top and obviously that's where it comes up because it's very high as you can see um does look a bit too long but i don't know it might fit well um got this in a size six again and i don't think this was too bad it was six pound um the material is very thin like if i hold it up with the double layers then you can't see but you can 
through the first layer. Um, but no, I feel, I feel like it's definitely more of a summer type thing to wear. I wouldn't want to wear this in the winter, number one, because it's very thin. And number two, obviously, it's like um, sleeveless. So I feel like this would go very well with um, maybe the white joggers or, some, or like some jeans and shorts. This bodysuit does have the like um, poppers. Um, normally it's either Velcro or these tight ones. So hopefully it will be comfortable, but I'm not too sure. It's basic, but you could dress it up or dress it down. So let's go see what it's like. Okay, on. so this is the bodysuit. Um, for the sizing, I definitely size down because the long bit which goes down here at the back and the front is definitely very big so it does make it a little bit uncomfortable as you can see it's very high but also i really like this i will try it on and show you in the mirror again top just looks like a normal vest um so if you were to have like a jacket on you'd probably just see this but yeah no it's simple Come so that's it at the side um the back's just um like a normal vest basically um it's not very much like i guess again you could dress it up or down um but if i was just wearing it around the house personally i'd just rather wear a vest but so now we have these um pretty little thing light wash disco skinny jeans in a size six i'm very unsure on this because i've had some jeans from here before which i got at christmas which i sent straight back because not gonna lie, I tried them on, they looked horrible. The fit was, weren't nice. So I'm just really praying, because I got these skinny jeans, that they'll fit and actually look nice. I feel like they looked a tiny bit lighter. It's either lighter or darker in the photo. I do have a pair of jeans that are very similar to this, which have rips in the knees, but I'm not keen on them because they're very low waisted. But these do again look quite high waisted. Um, I do like, folding their jeans over at the bottom and for a six they do look quite long um and they are just two pockets they feel a bit they do feel a bit more like jeggings a very soft denim but i'm not complaining because again that could be very comfortable um i feel like these would go with anything again dress them up with like heels really nice top um or dress them down just with trainers and like a basic white top or anything price for these jeans was 17 pound 60 which for a pair of jeans mostly i normally pay you could pay up you could pay up to 60 pound or i pay up to 60 pound for a pair of jeans um most places i know like new look are about 20 30 pound um so i think 17 pounds quite cheap for these and i just hope they're worth the price we have these jeans which i'm so happy they fit they fit like the leggings even though they're a size six they go right down to my ankles so i've um folded them up as you can tell i i literally love them even though the color doesn't look as um bright on the website definitely makes up for it like i love them it definitely impressed me compared to when I last ordered some jeans at that Christmas. Again, like just two pockets, the back. Yeah, no, I love these. If they're all like this, then I'll definitely be buying from them again. I don't know if it's because the other ones wasn't that skinny, but still, um, yeah, I actually love them. They go with anything, as you can see, I did try most of the tops on with them. And yeah. Okay, last but not least for the tops, we have this lilac basic jersey high neck crop top again size six um this was four pound 80 which again for a top seems a pretty decent price um okay it feels a little bit like the bodysuit material but like the necks doubled over so it does feel a little bit thicker i thought i'd go for something a bit different on camera it doesn't seem to pick up the purple for some reason but it is very purple just like the joggers um, i did get this in a size six and i feel like four pound eight girls again usual quality from pretty little thing decent um so yeah let's see what it looks this like on the top like i said um 
Again, it is quite thin, but not overly see-through. I really like it. This does look the same as it does on the website, which is good. Um, so yes, yeah. for the bottoms, we have these seamless two-tone contour leggings in a size small. Um, I'm quite excited to try some gym leggings from here because I, I do have a pair, but they were quite thin. Um, and I think they're about £25 which I think was a lot, seeing that the quality wasn't very good on them. Um, these were £16 and I think they were 20 without the discount. They did do these in, again, other colours, which I probably would prefer the bright pink to this colour. Um, but actually, the quality on this, like around the waistband, very stretchy. Um, and it's really like thick. I'm actually like surprised. Because I know that they sell out very fast on Pretty Little Thing on the gym wear. I feel like for £16, um, these feel great. But I just hope they fit. So let's see what they're like. Okay, so these are the sports leggings. Um, absolutely love them. They are a little bit tight to get on, but then also they are really stretchy. I love like how it kind of cinches your waist in but it's so that's so comfortable you wouldn't want to be wearing them in the summer because they're very thick um which was obviously good for the quality but not good for the summer and they're definitely more winter workout leggings um again for the length all about the same literally love them. just shove like t-shirt with them but yeah i quite like i'm getting used to the color i quite like it um and I feel like it'd be a really nice workout set, especially from Pretty Little Thing. I've definitely expected less and definitely will be keeping. Okay, moving on to the dresses, which I do have two of. We have got this, where is it? Blue mesh print rushed bodysuit dress in a size six. In fact, I see everyone getting this and I just really, really wanted to try it out. It does look a lot darker. And again, this print isn't something I'd usually go for. Um, I'd normally just go for quite basic. Okay, this is a back. Quite long straps. Um, I do quite like the neck, how it hangs down. It is double layered here, but I'm guessing that is just for the effect of it. Um, okay, so again, this quality is, has got a lot of layers which is a good sign um this is the bottom it's a ruffle type thing and then it has and it has this rushed oh, it's really hard to pick up on camera this rush detailing here with strings that you pull when you're wearing it <laughs> um to change the style of it this cost £16, was 20 without the discount, which normally from Pretty Little Thing I wouldn't pay because that's quite expensive. It's not expensive, but expensive for their clothes. But I definitely would uh, pay £20 for this for the quality. I mean, it's really good, but I just hope it fits right on me and it doesn't flop because... I've been waiting for this, I've been well excited. But yeah, but let's go see what it looks like. 100% recommend this. Definitely not my style. Wouldn't like, um, wanted to go on my comfort zone and um, try this. And I literally love it. Like it looks a tiny bit darker than the picture, but trust me, it's lush. I love the neck on it, how you can change it if you want it really long and then have it short if you want in, in the middle, like the ruffle. Um, you can tuck in. Um, and wear which I literally love. 10 out of 10 would recommend this dress. Um, to be honest, I didn't think that it would be good, but I uh, literally fallen in love. Last but not least, we have this petite black strappy rushed front mini dress. I got this in a size 10 and because it is petite, I couldn't find it in the clothing section. So, this cost £8 and it was on sale, so I didn't get any discount off it on top of the sale price. Um, okay, but it does look a bit 
It's very um stretchy. Looks like some cartons. <laughs> but it, I have seen dresses where people wear like this and it just looks amazing on. Um the length probably looks about right. Just like a little bit wide. Um but again for the material, double led at the front and it's just normal back which I feel like it does look quite cheap that way um but yeah hopefully um this looks quite nice on even though I don't think personally it's not my um style so I mean for eight pound you can't really go wrong but I know they do do their five pound dresses but com this compared to that five pound dress um quality it does feel a lot more better so let's go see what this looks like <laughs> let's go see what this looks like on oh, not a fan of this as you can see it looks quite wide like it fit like the black underneath it which i can't lift up because it's attached fits to me perfect it's like this ruffle bit comes out and it makes doesn't look very nice knocking on the top either not very flattering straps do fit better again the back does look very cheap so i'm not like keen on that um maybe if it was pulled in a little bit like that it would look kind of nice and maybe neck like that yeah that'd look a lot better but obviously it's not like that um i got this in petite thinking it fit but well the straps fit and the length's decent but definitely um not the biggest fan of this one mary might be able to see the ruffles better but like I said, pulled in like that would look a lot better. But yeah, I just think it looks cheap. Um, but it's all right. Like it's not see-through or anything. Um, it's got loads of nice layers, but definitely not for me. Ended on a bad note, but um, all the other clothes, <laughs> as you can see, turned out amazing. So I'm happy. Thank you guys so much for watching. I really hope you enjoyed this big PLT haul. Um, overall, I'm happy with most of the products. A few of the things I will be sending back because I personally don't like them. Um, except from obviously the black dress. I feel like it would look a little bit uh, better tighter. But um, except from that, I'm very impressed. I didn't think that this haul um, would turn out so good. But... At least I've got something to wear in quarantine. Please make sure you like and subscribe and leave a comment below what you want me to do next. I really, really want to do Opoly because um, some of their dresses and tops on there look lush. Um, I really like the look of their sportswear, but unfortunately, most of the stuff on Opoly that I like is out of stock. So I definitely want to also try Sheen. I've seen a lot of people try that recently. Um, but if there is any other places, please let me know in the comments and don't forget to subscribe. I'll see you in the next video.